hi, this is Nikki and I'm here to share the messages that I get from Spirit with you to help you on your journey to unconditional love. And unconditional love and all of the amazing things that that brings, not just your twin, but also magic that happens in your life, be that in health, wealth and happiness. So that's been a key theme recently, right? Is that the twin flame energy brings not just your twin, but also brings unbelievable abundance in every area of your life. And I'm sure that if you've been sharing these messages and resonating with my messages, then this will also be very applicable to you because I'm sure that you've been getting guidance that abundance is coming in every area of your life. So this is just the best confirmation ever. So I'm going to share this with you because this is, I'm, I'm hoping that this will give you like um, confirmation as it gave me today. So the first thing is, I've mentioned before that my flatmate is also, um, I'm definite that he is a twin flame as well, but just isn't aware of it and is kind of waking up a little bit, but still very much um, just thinking it's all, uh, just questioning things, put it this way, he's definitely questioning stuff. And um, the universe keeps giving him signs all the time. He sees 11, 11 all the time. Um, and has uh, asked me questions about, you know, stuff, but he is just, yeah, he's waking up. Anyway, so, and I've been getting the guidance, I have to do the lottery. And so I keep saying to him, Jace, you ha uh, keep saying to him, you have to do it, you have to do the lottery, we're going to win. Anyway, and so last night, we both get lottery tickets independently, right? Um, we go both get lucky dip tickets. So completely independently, completely in different shops, completely, totally independent of everything. Um, and we ch just checked the numbers, right? We both had the exact same first, second and final number. So out of six numbers, we both got the exact same three numbers and in the exact same positions. Um, so the chances of that happening with two lucky dip tickets completely bought in random places, completely bought um, uh, totally independently, is about as much, the odds of that happening are as much as winning the lottery. So perfect sign from spirit to say, it is going to happen in divine timing, just like your twin flame journey is going to happen in divine timing. The other brilliant thing about it is that you have a particular um, colour that is allocated to the ticket in the UK. I've been t saying recently that we've got to step into our go gold, gold stardust, the god goddess power. The ticket for me was gold, so you just can't make this up. I have a and b person that's staying with me at the moment. Right, the B and B person starts talking to me, and she's saying that her sister is a DJ. Her sister DJs at a hotel that I walk past all the time on the South Bank. This picture is actually the um, a picture of the Thames. This picture, I Google the picture because I'm looking at what are the odds of having two people in the same house getting the same three numbers on the lottery, um, and this is the picture that comes up with. <laughs> a boat just by this particular hotel <laughs> that this girl is, is who's staying with me. The best thing about this is the hotel, which is just after this bridge, is looks like this. It is actually a sea, it's based on a sea liner. It's based on an old 1920s ship. <laughs> you can't make this stuff up. I mean, it's just incredible. It basically is a sea liner. So not only are our divine masculines or divine counterparts coming home in, <laughs> but we are also having our monetary abundance coming home. Those ships are coming home. I Google this, I Google to, to find out what are the odds of having the two people in the same house, getting the exact same numbers in the exact same place. What is the picture that comes up? this i mean it's just it's just the connections and the jigsaw is just totally amazing in every way 
The other thing about this that is brilliant is during the summer, for the last six months or about six months ago, I started focusing on my own energy around money because I had a block. Now what the perfect thing about this is, is that my block happened, I did that through a series of energy clearing sessions. I identified what my block was, and my block was because when I was seven years old, I had collected all of my money and I had it in a handbag that my parents got me from when they went to Greece. It was like a brown leather handbag. I was walking along the river with my friend. She took my bag off me and basically spun it around her head and threw it into the canal. 